Welcome back to Love and Junk Food. I'm Laura. I'm John. Today we're trying some new coffee that we're really excited to share with you. If you've been following our channel, you know that I've been trying uh, different coffee products probably for the past month or so. Mm -hmm. um, in well, little... actually, your whole dang life. <laughs> yeah, my whole dang life. But for the videos, we've been doing shorts uh, for the past month, and it's, I like it. It's been going well. Mm -hmm. It's kind of get me outside of my normal coffee, you know, routine and into something new. John is a, I drink my coffee black and I drink it every day, all day, every day kind of guy. He loves coffee. I sure do. Right? I am a, every once in a while, give me a frappuccino, a cappuccino, an iced coffee in the summer, every once in a while kind of girl. We're going to try to make us both happy in yeah. this one video. We'll see. So this is a product from Javi. And Javi is a company that produces this micro-dose coffee concentrate. Uh, we've never tried a coffee product like this. No! Um, it's 100% uh, Arabica coffee, uh, artisan roasted, uh, but it's concentrated. So basically it just says simply take one to two teaspoons of micro-dose and mix it with your favorite liquid for a perfect cup of coffee. So you could do water. You could do milk, you could do it cold, you could do it hot, mm -hmm. and then there's a bunch of different recipes that you can make with it. I'm sure you could do something uh, with a little something something in it, if that's your kind of thing. Oh, sure, sure. So, that this is a six ounce bottle, but it says it has 30 servings in one bottle. Wow. So. Here's what I like about it, without even tasting it, is the amount of space this takes up, oh, yeah. and the amount of waste compared to some other coffee products. Right. Yeah. Right? So it's a six ounce bottle, six ounces of liquid in there. I mean, it's a it's a glass bottle, it's a little bit heavy, but mm -hmm. it's not bad to take with you. Um, you know, and it's, it's a lot better like, um, you know, than having to carry something to brew coffee and stuff like that. So easy to travel. Well, a lot of workplaces have the hot water dispenser and you could just have this in your desk or oh, yeah. whatever at work. Right, right. So a lot of applications. Have, yeah, always have coffee at the ready. So next in the kitchen, we're going to make some coffee and then back here to try it. All right, so today we're going to make three different coffee drinks using the Javi Coffee Concentrate. Uh, the first one we're going to do is just a basic coffee. Uh, just like the package directions say, one to two teaspoons of the coffee concentrate. I also have some hot water here, so coffee concentrate, add that hot water. And give it a stir. The second coffee that I'm going to make is an iced coffee. So again, we're going to use the Javi Coffee Concentrate. According to the package directions, one to two teaspoons. Oop, a little bit more there. Now we're going to add cold milk. And give it a stir. All right, the last coffee drink that we're gonna to try today is going to be a maple cinnamon latte. Uh, for that, I've got cinnamon, I've got the Javi, of course, a little maple syrup, and uh, some whipped cream. Uh, I've also heated up some milk. So, we're gonna start off by taking this wonderful Canadian maple syrup, and we're just gonna drizzle that all along the sides. There is a recipe on the Javi website uh, for this maple latte. I think they do theirs cold 
and um, about two tablespoons of maple syrup. Uh, next, I'm going to add the Javi coffee concentrate. Again, we're going to use two teaspoons. Next, we're going to add the heated milk. And because we're trying so much, we're not going to make a full drink, but I am going to add some whipped up. And a little cinnamon. Alright, we're back. It smells amazing. <laughs> I can't wait to try these. Me too. Um, I think we should probably start off with just regular old plain black coffee. I think you're correct. Yeah, that one's hot. Hmm. When was the last time I had black coffee? I don't know. It's been a while. <laughs> it's been a while. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna uh, judge the company by how I feel about black coffee. We'll see. Yeah, well we've got some other ones here for you too, so. Okay. It's good, but black coffee isn't usually my thing, so. Yeah, black coffee is usually my thing. Mm -hmm. um, that's good. I think that is, um, I think, you know, you would dial this into your personal preferences. Right. And I think that I would just tweak this a little bit by adding a little bit more water or, you know, whatever. Mm -hmm. And I think I would just get it perfect. Um, it's really good. I think the flavor is good. Definitely tastes like coffee because that's what it is. Right. Okay. Next. All right. Next, we'll go with the iced coffee. Now. Okay. Yeah. Let's go with one of the straws they sent us. Fancy. ASMR for you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't put any sweetener in for Laura, so I apologize for that, but... Mmm, that's good. Needs to be sweet. But I like it like that, a lot. Yeah, just cold, milk, a little ice. Mm -hmm. It's good, I do, I like, um, what I hate is when you get a coffee drink like this, like a, a iced coffee or whatever, and you really can't taste any coffee in it. It's right. just, you know, a sweet, sugary drink, but, um... That's good. I taste the milk and then I taste the, you know, little coffee bitiness after mm -hmm. that. Yeah, really I like good. that. Now this is the one that you might really like because this is the maple latte. Good to me. One of, if, if you're not familiar with our channel, Laura's, one of her favorite flavors is maple. Not one of Laura's favorite flavors. Laura's the favorite, favorite flavor. flavor. Maple. <laughs> yes. Which I didn't taste it beforehand because, you know, we're doing a taste test here, so I don't know. Ooh, that's nice. And the other difference, too, is this is a creamy coffee Ooh. drink that's iced, and that's warm. Yeah. Ooh, that's my favorite. And it's not too mapley. I just really like the sweetener in it, I think. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, hey! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I just, I like, the, I like that it's sweetened. Um, and the i don't know maybe that it's the holidays and whatever just the warm mm -hmm. i don't know it's very comforting yeah right? that is really good mm -hmm. so basically that's a winner for me they're oh. all winners but i love that one yeah that's my favorite too it is yeah that's that's really <clears throat> good okay that's really good you know you've got your day-to-day -day coffees like i wake up in the morning and i have to have a cup of coffee right you know and black coffee is the way that i drink it but, you know, you've got, like, coffees throughout the whole day. So, you know, this maple latte is delicious, so. I enjoy coffee two different ways. One, as a dessert. 
Mm -hmm. or with dessert, I guess I could say too. But as a dessert, you know how some people sip on hot chocolate? I love a hot coffee, a hot creamy coffee yeah. like that as a dessert. And the other way I like it is refreshing, over ice, sweet, Yeah. like on a hot day. Yeah. It's great. Yum. This uh, um, maple latte would be great iced or hot. You know, I think it'd be great both ways. I think so too. Here's the thing. Never have I ever until today had a maple latte like that before. Yeah. I've had a maple everything, almost everything else in my <laughs> life, but never a maple latte. That's amazing. Yep. Uh, each bottle runs $17.95, uh, but you are getting 30 servings out of one little bottle. 30 servings for how much? Uh, seventeen, 17. ninety five. Okay. Now, if you buy more than one bottle, you get discounts. So if you buy three, um, they're fourteen ninety five each. So you get a little bit of a discount on there. So, uh, uh, oh, go ahead. I was just gonna say another application for this, and we didn't really talk. John was off making coffee, and I was off doing other things. But another application, I can see this being really useful. I mentioned the office, but also. In our life, we love to go to Airbnbs, we love to go yeah. camping and, you know, be outdoorsy and that kind of thing where you always have hot water. Right. Right? Like in our situation, if we go to an Airbnb, we may not have a particular coffee maker. Yeah. And so we could always have this with us and we could, I mean, we always have cold water too. We could always sure. bring along our creamer. We could have an iced coffee or a hot coffee wherever and all we need is water yeah so, I like that and if we're packing and traveling this is a very small container it doesn't take up like if we had to bring our coffee maker we had to bring the coffee and yeah all the stuff yeah that's one of the uh, benefits that they mentioned on their website I took a look oh. at that uh, one of the benefits was uh, it's quick and it's easy mm -hmm. uh, they mentioned that it's cheap and it's versatile so you can use you know Use it for hot, cold, whatever you want in literally seconds. True. <laughs> True. If you've not, if you've tried this before, let us know what you thought of it. And if you have not tried the maple latte, I highly suggest you try to go make you one because that's what I'm going back to. Yep. So two of these drinks were just basically right off of the back of the package. And one was from their website. They do have web, uh, what? They have recipes on their website. Um, I would love, I can't wait to experiment with this. I would love to do some cooking, yeah. maybe some baking. We were thinking of making like a coffee cheesecake yeah. in the future or something, something else. So be looking for those videos to drop. Maybe we'll do some shorts where we create oh, other sure. things using our new friend here. I didn't even know that that existed before in the, in the world, the coffee concentrate concepts right like i didn't even know the micro micro dose micro dose yeah uh was available in coffee <laughs> <laughs> right you know what i mean i think that's all we have for today yeah come find us on social media if you haven't already especially instagram that's where we spend the most of our time over on instagram we love it there nice positive energy on instagram that's right we also have a new channel if you didn't know and a game channel and make sure you're subscribed to this channel before Please. you go. We'll put links to all of that and to Javi down in the comments below. Also, let us know how you take your coffee. Are you a cream only? Yeah. Are you a black coffee drinker? Do you like it sweet and creamy in the way that I do? Or however you like it, let us know in the comments. Now, if you love trying something new. Yeah. Or coffee. Yes. Or us. Or the video. Give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps us grow when you do that. That's all we have for today. That's it, guys. See you next time. Bye.